हेलो एवरी वन टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न अबाउट द पार्ट्स ऑफ अ सर्कल आई एम हैविंग अ सर्कल विद मी फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वी नीड टू नो वेयर इज द सेंटर ऑफ दिस सर्कल आई एम गोइंग टू फोल्ड इट लाइक दिस फर्स्ट एंड देन लाइक दिस so when i open it i get a point this point this point is the center of the circle i am marking it with green color so this is the center of the circle now let's talk about the perimeter of this circle so this is the perimeter of the circle and there is a special name for it it is known as circumference of the circle so this black line is the perimeter or the circumference of the circle so now if i draw a part of the circumference so this green line it is a part of the circumference is known as the arc so now let's talk about the other parts of the circle in the beginning i folded it like this folded it like this and i got a line over here along the fold let's draw this line do you know what is the special thing about this line it passes through the center of the circle and it has a special name it's called the diameter of the circle now first we need to understand that a circle can have infinite diameter see i can make as many lines as possible passing through the center of the circle and touching the circumference i can draw as many lines as i want so i can draw countless lines so that means there are infinite diameters possible if i draw a line half of the diameter that means i start from the center and go till the circumference this line also has a special name it is called the radius of the circle and like diameter infinite radii are possible now just uh, concentrate on the word radius and radii so these are radii is the plural of radius so infinite radii are possible so these were the things now i was folding so in such a way that the fold pa passed through the center now if i fold it in such a manner that it is not passing through the center like anywhere if i make a fold i get another line yes this line also has a special name first let me draw it it has a special name it is called chord so any line that cuts the circumference at two points is called a chord now let's talk about areas diameter divides the circle into two parts so the name of these two parts is semicircle this one and this one the chord also divides the circle into two parts which are called segments this is the major segment and this one 
is the minor segment. This is the major segment and this is the minor segment. Now, sector. What is a sector? If I fold the circle from the center, this is the sector of a circle. See how it looks like the slice of a pizza and because it is has been cut from the center so it is known as the sector so any part which is being cut from the center like its edges are cut touching the center is known as the sector it can be made in any way see if i half it This is also a sector. So I hope the parts of the circle are clear to you. Thanks for watching.